What's up, YouTube? <coughs> this your girl Nesta from the 773. <coughs> this your girl Nesta from the 773. Uh, check this out, man. I was just uh, sitting here doing what I do, right? Looking at these videos. And you know, we're going to talk about young ass thugs today. I'm so tired of seeing these young ass thugs. Talking all this shit they don't know about. You know what I'm saying? Not saying that I'm so fucking old that I know everything. But the thing that kills me, these young bitches getting real studs <coughs> like me. Making it, making me look bad. You know what I'm saying? Making real studs look bad. They out here talking all this bullshit. First of all, they don't know what the fuck stud means, evidently. You know? Being a fucking stud, it ain't walking around pretending you a nigga or wanna be a man. No. Y'all done got the game all fucked up. Being a stud is being confident knowing that you're the aggressive dominant in that relationship. Not, <clears throat> not walking around like, yeah, baby, what's up, you know, all that your boy, you know. <laughs> and all that shit. You, you ain't got to do that. You try to prove a point. Who you try to prove? You, your, yourself or that, yo, your girl. Oh, before I continue, what's up, damn daughter seven? What's up, baby? I see you. Wow, honey, it's got that scope of your love. But uh, anyway, getting back to the point that I'm trying to make today is these young ass studs get on here like this one girl. I ain't gonna mention no name, but I subscribe to her. She get on here talking about she hate when films look like studs. Bitches, you confused? Why you worried about this bitch? Worry about your bitch. You know what I'm saying? Then you got these studs that want to walk around all tough and rough and want they self to look like men and whooping on these films. That shit is not cool, G. When has it ever been cool to whoop a woman's ass? You know what I'm saying? If y'all two females, y'all gonna scrap. But you ain't gotta be that bitch just I'm gonna whoop your ass, bitch. You better not do this. You better not do that. And who do this? Bitch, why is you so insecure? That be the insecure bitches. Once you get yourself, you and yourself together, and then you worry about your chick. You should have no problems after that. You know what I'm saying? <sighs> and while we on the topic of young studs, let's talk about these fake-ass films. I know a lot of y'all gonna be mad, but I don't get no fuck. But a fake-ass film is one of these bitches that they think is cool to be gay. Bitch, this is a lifestyle. This is not a game. The revolution will be televised. <laughs> But what I'm saying, these fake ass films, they want to holler at you and shit. And they got a nigga at the crib. Or this bitch just plopped out a baby two months ago. And talking about, I'm gay, I'm gay. Bitch, are you serious? Man, these bitches five years from now, they're going to be married up with a house full of babies. You know what I'm saying? And talking about, oh, I stepped off the scene for a little while, but I'm back. Bitch, no. No, you're bisexual and you always going to be bisexual. You know? And these young ass studs, once y'all get some knowledge about y'all self, y'all out here, all on the thing, grinding and adult. that is not cute. That is not cute. You want to be a hot commodity? And when you get 45, what the fuck you going to do there? You still going to be on grind, grind. <laughs> no, nah, but that shit is so fucking funny to me. What I'm trying to say, bitches, get yourself together. You don't want to work on labels, don't work on labels. You know, call yourself you. But if you going to be a motherfucking stud, you know, you represent yourself to the fucks. You know what I'm saying? Don't be out there on that bullshit and still, you know, fucking dude and down the street and shit like that. That That is not cool. That is not cute. And for you bisexual bitches, you know, you want to fuck with a stud and she been doing this shit for umpteen years. And you got a nigga at the crib, at the crib, bitch, you will lose your life. This is a lifestyle. I keep telling y'all this ain't no fucking joke. You know, you fucking with this stud or whoever, and she find out you got a nigga, and she been putting her mouth on you. Man, that's ground for termination, baby. You know, that's, that's a, a severe violation of codes, ethics, and everything else. There's too much shit out here. You know what I'm saying? You young bitches, you young studs, don't be going around licking on everything. That shit ain't cute. That shit is not hot. That is not a good look at all. You know? <clears throat> like I said, you ain't got to be walking around here pretending you some guy. Those people like that have identity crisis. Maybe y'all want to be uh, FTMs or something. 
y'all need uh, transgendered labels <laughs> or something like that. But it, it, it's not that serious, ladies. If you're comfortable with yourself and who you are, you ain't got to prove no points to nobody else. So y'all y'all get studs, get this shit together, represent right. And you fake ass fams, y'all stay with the rest of the fake ass fam. Don't nobody want that shit. Anyway, this is stuff. Put a little rant for your ass. <laughs> As usual. Nesta from the 773. That tatted up stud. <laughs>